Welcome to Dunmore, home of the Bucks, as well as some holiday cheer from your local police department. Dunmore always takes care of Dunmore. That's how it always has been uh, growing up. That's what I know. Several local businesses have answered the call and are helping cram the cruiser with Dunmore PD. Um, this is an event that they started last year um, th that provides gifts um, to, to families that would otherwise go without them. The drop-off locations all have community ties, whether you're picking up prescriptions, working out, or making a charitable deposit. So as a community bank, one of our core values is to give back to the community, so any chance that we have the opportunity to help, especially during the holidays for time in need, is extremely um, an important part for Fidelity Family to help out with. This event is far from the only involvement the Greater Scranton YMCA has with their community through the year, but it does strike a special chord. We have an awesome relationship with them, so when they asked us to participate, we were more than happy to do so. Uh, we serve so many community members here, um, so we see the need, and we're so happy to be able to give back to community members in need. Dunmore police say they couldn't give back to their community like they do without their partners and fellow Dunmoreans. The, their generosity and outpouring of support to us on this campaign is what makes it successful. The community feels the same about their men and women in uniform. We are fortunate in Dunmore to have a very supportive community, but then also a forward-thinking police department that really does more for our community than just protect us on a daily basis. The amount of donations is a bit behind this year, heading into the holidays. This year we, we partnered up with Home for the Holidays, and the event was scheduled for December 1st in Dunmore Corners, and we had that rain and ice storm that just, you know, put an end to the, the event. But there is still time to pitch in on the effort. The donation locations will be accepting until the 13th this Friday, um, and then we hopefully will be out next week delivering all these gifts. Some who are collecting those toys say even dropping off a pack of batteries to help with someone else's donation goes a long way. In Dunmore, Kevin Hayes, Eyewitness News.